What would you give up for a cause you deeply believe in? Today we're going to dive deep into the concept of sacrifice, using the story of Abraham as our guide. Now let's strip away the religious connotations for a moment and view Abraham as a symbol, a symbol of the universal human experience of sacrifice. Abraham, a man deeply connected to his soul, was willing to sacrifice his son. This wasn't about a father giving up his child, instead, it was a profound example of surrendering the familiar for the promise of the unknown. Abraham was ready to let go of a deeply cherished part of his life because he believed in something greater, something beyond the known. He was willing to step into the unknown, trusting in the transformative power of surrender and resilience. This act of Abraham's sacrifice resonates with us not because it's a religious story, but because it's a human story. It's a story about the trials we face, and the sacrifices we make in the pursuit of our beliefs, our dreams, and our deepest truths. It's about the courage to let go of what we hold dear for the promise of something greater, something more meaningful. And isn't that what sacrifice is all about? It's about relinquishing something of value, something we hold dear, for the sake of something we believe is greater. It's about the courage to step into the unknown, trusting in our capacity to endure, to adapt, and to grow. It's about the resilience of the human spirit in the face of adversity. As we delve deeper into the story of Abraham, we find a narrative that transcends religious boundaries, touching the hearts of spiritual seekers across the globe. It's a narrative of surrender and resilience, of faith in the face of uncertainty, and of the transformative power of sacrifice. So let's continue on this journey, exploring the many facets of sacrifice and resilience in our lives. Let's explore how we can embody the spirit of Abraham, surrendering the familiar for the promise of the unknown, trusting in our capacity to endure and triumph. Abraham's sacrifice serves as an enduring testament to the transformative power of surrender and resilience. Imagine you're Abraham, not bound by chains of faith but tethered to the depths of your own soul. Picture yourself on a journey of self-discovery and spiritual awakening, a path riddled with uncertainty yet illuminated by an inner light. This is the tale of Abraham, an allegory of resilience and the human spirit's capacity to endure and triumph. Abraham's journey in essence is a quest for meaning, purpose and truth. It's a journey that transcends religious boundaries and resonates deeply with the human experience, a tale that echoes in the hearts of seekers across the globe. As Abraham navigates the tumultuous terrain of life's trials and tribulations, his unwavering faith is his compass, guiding him through the storm. Each challenge he encounters is an opportunity for growth, a stepping stone on the path to spiritual awakening. His resilience is not born out of stubbornness, but a profound understanding of surrender and acceptance. In the realm of family and parenthood, moments of sacrifice and selflessness often mirror Abraham's journey. Just as Abraham willingly ventured into the unknown, parents too embark on a journey filled with uncertainties. This journey is not merely a biological process, but a sacred odyssey of nurturing souls and fostering growth. Consider the sleepless nights spent soothing a crying child, or the countless hours devoted to their education and development. These acts of sacrifice, though they may seem ordinary, are a testament to the transformative power of love and selflessness. Just as Abraham was willing to surrender what was most precious to him, parents too make sacrifices in the best interests of their children. Parenthood is not always a smooth journey. There are times of hardship, times of doubt, times when the weight of responsibility feels overwhelming. But remember Abraham's journey. Despite the hardships he faced, he remained steadfast, guided by an unwavering faith in his purpose. The story of Abraham serves as a powerful reminder that sacrifice is not a loss, but a gain. It is through sacrifice that we learn to prioritize the needs of others above our own, shaping our character and molding us into better individuals. In the role of a parent, the sacrifices made are not in vain. Each sacrifice is an investment in the future, a seed sown with love and care that will one day bear fruit. It is through these sacrifices that we shape the lives of our children, instilling in them values of compassion, empathy, and resilience. As we navigate the challenges of parenthood, let us draw strength from the story of Abraham. Let us embrace the trials with grace and resilience trusting in the transformative power of love and sacrifice. Just as Abraham's journey led him to spiritual enlightenment, our journey as parents can lead us to a deeper understanding of love and selflessness. It is through this journey of sacrifice and love that we truly begin to understand the essence of parenthood. It is a journey that shapes not only the lives of our children but our own lives as well. 
Embrace the trials of parenthood with grace and resilience, trusting in the transformative power of love and sacrifice. In our professional journey, we often encounter challenges and obstacles that demand resilience. Just as Abraham embarked on a journey guided by his inner calling, we too navigate the often turbulent seas of work and career. We face daunting challenges, unexpected obstacles and at times, the unknown. Consider Abraham's journey, he was not driven by worldly rewards or recognition but by a deep-seated yearning for spiritual awakening, a quest for meaning and purpose. This is akin to our professional lives. Often we are not merely chasing monetary success or accolades, but a sense of fulfillment and purpose. We are driven by the desire to make a difference, to contribute to the world in our own unique ways and in doing so find our own place in it. But, the path to fulfillment is seldom smooth. It is fraught with setbacks, disappointments and detours that can leave us feeling disheartened and lost. It is during these challenging times that the spirit of resilience becomes our guiding light. Resilience in the professional realm is about cultivating a deep sense of purpose and integrity. It's about staying true to our values. Even when the road gets tough, it's about having the courage to persevere, to keep moving forward, even when the destination seems elusive. Remember Abraham's unwavering resolve to follow his inner calling. This serves as a beacon of inspiration for us as we navigate the complexities of our careers. It reminds us that true success lies not in the external accolades but in the alignment of our actions with our inner truths. Just as Abraham's journey was guided by an inner light, we too must learn to trust in the guiding light of our own intuition. It's about believing in our abilities, trusting in our judgment, and having faith in our capacity to overcome challenges. It's about embracing the trials of our professional journey with courage and resilience, knowing that each challenge is an opportunity for growth and transformation. So as we traverse our professional paths, let us draw inspiration from Abraham's journey. Let us cultivate resilience and integrity and keep our inner light shining bright. Embrace the trials of your professional journey with courage and resilience, trusting in the guiding light of your own intuition. In the midst of mental or physical adversity, Abraham's story offers solace and strength. So let us embark on the final chapter of Abraham's journey, where we explore its profound implications for our mental and physical well-being. Abraham's journey is a testament to the power of resilience, a quality that shines brightest when we're navigating the storms of life. Just as he faced trials with unwavering faith, we too can harness the strength of our spirit to overcome our challenges whether they be mental, physical or both. When we encounter physical adversity like illness or injury it's all too easy to succumb to despair. Yet Abraham's journey reminds us that resilience is not just about enduring, it's about growing. It's about finding the courage to face our fears, to embrace our pain, and to transform it into a catalyst for growth and healing. In the realm of mental well-being, Abraham's story resonates with equal potency. The trials he faced, the choices he made were not just physical ordeals but mental battles. His resilience, his ability to surrender, to trust in the process, mirrors our own struggles with anxiety, depression and other mental health challenges. His journey serves as a beacon, illuminating the path towards mental resilience, towards acceptance and ultimately, towards healing. But beyond resilience, the story of Abraham is a tale of renewal. Just as he emerged from his trials with renewed faith and strength, we too can transform our adversities into opportunities for growth and self-discovery. Adversity, whether mental or physical, can be a powerful teacher, guiding us towards a deeper understanding of ourselves and our place in the world. In the face of adversity, we have a choice. We can let it define us, confine us, or we can choose to rise above it. We can choose to harness the power of resilience to embrace the potential for healing and renewal, and in doing so, we can find solace and strength in the most challenging of circumstances. In the depths of our own souls lies the power to transcend adversity and emerge stronger and more resilient than before. Just like Abraham, we too can triumph in our journey towards mental and physical well-being.